Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Kathy's Corner, Seed in the Sand, and this is chapter four of um, Lost Heart, All is Well. And what I wanted to talk about today was about feeling lost, feeling like you don't belong, feeling like you don't fit in, feeling like you don't matter, um, and like with friendships and family and relationships and work and um, home, um, sometimes you just don't fit, you don't fit in. And uh, whether you're like a rose or a wildflower or a garden vegetable or a, <laughs> a garden flower, a um, what else, what else is there, you know, like a fruit, vine, um, whatever it is that you are, um, if you're not cultivated in the right environment, at the right place, at the right time, with the right weather conditions, um, it can really make you feel as if you're not, um, you know, you're not in the right place, not in, you're not belonging, you're not fitting in, you're not with, you know, like, with it, in it, in a, a part of it, and, um, in my personal life, like, my friendship life, it's, I have a few friends that I'm friends with, um, and I talk to on a regular basis, but it's not like we go out and do common interests together, or go to craft fairs, or coffee, or, um, different types of things like that. I mean, I do that with my boyfriend. Um, um, but as far as friendships go, I really do miss having something close, having something that I value in my life. And you work so hard to build that friendship and then it just goes away. Um, sometimes it can just go away. And it hurts. It hurts a lot. And, um, I don't know, I guess I just, I'm at a place now that I long for real, authentic understanding, unconditional love, unconditional friendship, unconditional relationships, unconditional, you know, you love me for who I am and I love you for who you are. And... Um, I'm not finding that a lot, you know, I'm finding a lot of judgment, a lot of criticism, a lot of, um, uh, uh, hurt, you know, like you just, you're not fitting in. And I don't know why it seems like the more progressive you get on your spiritual journey, the more lonely it is. Um, and it's not that I'm lonely because... I miss, I miss, um, you know, like God or heaven or whatever it is. I miss having somebody that I can be myself with, um, besides my boyfriend, um, and my dog. Um, and maybe that's why I do these channels to say, this is who I am. And if you don't like who I am, that's fine. Just keep going on to the next video. But if you do like who I am, just say, you know, I I understand what you're going through. I or I I can relate to this. I can I can I can understand what you're talking about. You know, maybe I'm maybe I'm just talking to myself and that's okay. And because it's healing for me to talk to myself. So um all right. So these are the tarot, classic tarot cards, um, and one card is for the past, one card is for the present, and one card is for the future. And of course, like five cards fall out, so there's too many, too many there. All right, we'll go with this one. For the past, it's the Three of Cups celebration having fun, enjoying life. That's where I want to be. And then one for the present. And um, 
So it is the five, I'm sorry, six of wands. Again, celebration, celebration, celebration. Just celebrate life. Celebrate growing by yourself. You don't have to have other people. You don't have to have the the conditions of others to be celebrating. But it is nice to celebrate with others. And I'm sorry, there were two there. For the future, we'll go with this one. And that is the two of wands. And that is like a discovery, self-discovery. Um, learning about the world, learning about your journey, learning about um, learning about um, your path. I'm going to do one more. This one's kind of popping out. In the uh, Ace of Pentacles. And that's, you know, fresh starts, new beginning, planting seeds. Um, the whole, the whole basis of my, my talk is planting seeds and developing that seed and conditioning that seed into something beautiful, not something that you want to make it for selfish reasons, but because of who that seed is and where that seed belongs and what that seed has to endure. It's beautiful. It's just beautiful. So, all right. I hope everybody has a great day today. We'll see you tomorrow.